I'll give you the floor on Luca. I know what you said, uh, but I'll give you to the to the show quadcast listeners and viewers right now the performance that uh, Luca came up with uh, in that overtime game to not the series at two games apiece. Um, people are referring to magic than than you know the time where he played center in place of the injured Kareem. Where where do you think that stands and he stands for you, Kenny? I mean. What makes a great a great is not the is not a series or or or, or a season. It's the consistency over several. Uh, that's what makes LeBron who he is. It's like over the years, like he's done this. Uh, and so, I mean, as great as that 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 um, exhibition was, of what he did, you know, it's the consistency of doing that night in and night out, playoff time after playoff time, and winning series and advancing. Uh, I think that's what makes you know, the great, the great. Now, arguably, you know, we look at what I always said when he came into the bubble, this is not 2020 Luca. This is the Luca we would have been seeing next year, the MVP candidate. So you talk about him, you talk about Donovan Mitchell, you talk about Dame Lillard, and you talk about, you know, even a guy like uh, Devin Booker, you know, where they've all taken that like, oh, I'm here for 21, 20 the 2021 season. This is how they're probably going to look next year because, you know, that long layoff allowed them to kind of retool and rethink. Yeah, and you could throw Jamal Murray in that mix too, which I guess leads me to ask because we haven't hit the Clippers yet and we we, we will. Who are we not talking about? Is it the Raptors who just steamrolled uh, the Nets? Um, Who who are we not talking about to get a a shot here to, to take this wide open seemingly tournament you know i I still think that um you know the clipper series isn't over you know i I wouldn't say it's over uh if if, uh you know they have a couple of days or a day and and if porzingis is able to come back you know that still could be an interesting series but the rockets you know with russ westbrook you know if he comes back you know and he's able to play then all of a sudden you're like, wow, this could be a mix that we, you know, we hadn't seen. I think the one thing that we've seen over the playoffs with James Harden is the, that he gets wore down as the series go on because the ball is in his hand so much in that system. But with Russell Westbrook, he doesn't. Um, you know, and that's what I think Oklahoma City's taking advantage of is like he's got the ball so much in his hand, we could contain some of these things that happen now. Uh, so, I, and, and Utah, you know. With Donovan Mitchell, the way he's playing, right, and the way he's shooting the basketball, and the and the ability that he's playing at, you know, those teams, both Denver and, and Utah, with Jamal Murray, those they they all the West is wild and it is wide open. Yeah, the the Rockets and the the uh, Thunder are playing to tipping off five hours from now, and it's just in a couple hours from now, apparently, according to Woj, that Russell Westbrook's going to give it a try. Um, do you think it's imperative that he play in this game five, the way that things are playing out right now? Um, the way that the Rockets have shot the ball uh, at the end of game four and just died by the three that they frequently live by? Kenny? Yes, I think it's important for him to play because, you know, because even though as great as, as uh, James is, I think he does need that, okay, I don't have to be the initiator all the time. Maybe I could be the finisher. Um, and, you know, kind of like LeBron did all of his career. He, you know, Dwayne Wade and, and Kyrie Irving and all of those guys who weren't made it easy for him to not always be the initiator. Uh, and I don't think Russ, I, don't, I mean, I don't think James gets that. And, um, you know, those guys are really great players, but to be the initiator on every single play, on every single possession, would wear anywhere. Hey, you watched all the way to the end. Thanks for that. Watch more right here.